Hello everybody, today I'm going to be showing you the best coding or notepad batch files for uh, Windows computers. And so it'll look like this. Uh, this is a coding I made. It's, I renamed the Internet Explorer and put the Internet Explorer icon, but it's actually going to shut down your computer. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So first you want to open Notepad. And then... Shift, hit shift 2 at echo off and then say echo which is what you're gonna say on the screen echo uh, this is pay back for what you did And then you do Paul, which is going, which it'll say at the bottom of the screen. Uh, press any key to continue, and then once you do that, it will shut down your computer. So you type shut down. Dot exe, and then minus s or R if you want to restart, but I'm going to do minus S so they think uh, it's not going to do anything or it's going to shut down for good and not turn on again. And then minus T, which is time. And then I'm going to do two seconds, but you can do like 110 or 110 seconds, but I'm going to do two or even zero. But I'm going to do two because then they can read the thing that's going to come on the screen so you do minus c which is a comment saying uh you can say virus happen virus occurred uh register files deleted register files deleted or something along those lines I'm gonna just gonna say virus destroyed uh, or virus happened and then now you want to file save as to your desktop or if you have a removable removable disk you can do that but I'm going to do desktop and then say internet explorer that bat so it has to be a batch file and then you save that to your desktop now I'll minimize this here it is I don't want to click on it because my mouse is acting weird and then once you open this it'll uh, shut down your computer after they do that so I can go to properties to make it look like Internet Explorer and then oh yeah you have to make a shortcut create shortcut here it is the shortcut to there you can hide this somewhere but this right there then properties and then change the icon and then hit OK if that appears. Then drag around three quarters of the way through. And then you'll find the Internet Explorer icon. And hit Apply. OK. And then Explorer here. I'll rename this so... Oh, I deleted it. Here it is. Restore. So I'll go over here. My mouse is acting weird, so it doesn't let me drag things. So rename, rename, then Internet Explorer.
And then once you have Internet Explorer, you open it, and then it says, this is payback for what you did, and then I'll shut down your computer, which I don't want to do, because then this video will end. The next code is very long, so I'll have this in the description as second code, and the first code will be in the description too, so all the codes I'm going to do are in the description. So, uh, just copy and paste this in Notepad. It has to be Notepad or else it won't work in Word or any other thing. And so here it is, that Echo Off Echo Virus Scanner would like to scan your computer. Pause CLS, which is clear. Echo Scanning. Pause CLS DIR slash S. Pause CLS. Echo Virus Detected and is deleting files so then people get all scared. And then Pause CLS. Echo, do you want to stop it? Pause CLS DIR slash S. Pause CLS. Echo Virus Remove. Pause Exit. So save as, that was a lot, desktop, by your us, scanner, dot bat, and then I'll save that, minimize this just in case, and here's virus scanner, and virus scanner would like to scan your computer, press any key to continue, Scanning. There's that. Virus detected. Do you want to stop it? Virus removed. Exit. So it's pretty short, but it takes a lot of coding, as you can see here. So this will be in the description too. So, uh, that's it for this video because it's six minutes long. So I'm just gonna end it right now. So thank you for watching and goodbye.